calling to church 60 years later. <laughs> wow, wow. And what a, what a great one. Glory to God in the highest and on earth, peace, goodwill toward men. They're just so beautiful. Wow, that is amazing to think how many times it has been rung through the years for such joyous moments of all the weddings that are being done to ringing them in remembrance of the bombing downtown at the Murrah building to ringing them in the remembrance of the Twin Towers and our attacks to all the different worship services. It's uh, been the bells that have called us to worship for 60 years. And it's gonna be the bells that continue to call us to worship for another 60 years. And that's exciting. And such a blessing to get to see them up close and to touch them and to read the inscriptions. It's just, it's just a blessing for all of us. My grandfather, who's passed now, um, was actually involved in the original installation. So it was pretty neat for us to be a part of it again. Yeah, we're gonna need a, a big crane. <laughs> These have been up there 60 years. That's impressive. It's so beautiful. Normally they're 185 feet up and we don't really get a chance to go up there. And I think it's great that uh, we're able to refurbish them and uh, they'll be around for, for another 60 years for uh, future generations of St. Luke's. Probably won't get the opportunity to do that again unless we climb up the tower. Okay. <laughs> Love hearing them, and I can't wait to hear them when they're all brand new. Gentle. We've listened to them for a lifetime, so it's nice to see them down close and personal. Beautiful. I can't imagine how much more they're going to be improved when they come back. It's impressive. I intend to have my picture taken with them to send to my grandchildren. I'm always writing them about St. Luke's. I thought it was really neat. I can't wait to see them restored. I just think that they're amazing. My father and grandfather were Vernon Vineyard Harris. To see my grandfather's name here is incredible. I, I was the only grandchild that never knew him. He died three months before I was born. So to be a part of all of this and to be a part of restoring the bells and the history of St. Luke's and um, touching my family life, it's wonderful. Very thankful. We came earlier and I just got all teary-eyed. And then other members of Harris Foundation have been down this week to take pictures and uh, to see things, so it means a lot to us.
I think everybody's going to be thrilled with the new layout and the, and the way the, the new, the new Carillon will play. Thank you.